the cute little doll oh my gosh you guys i don't know about this i don't know if i want to freaking i don't know if i want to go in there gaming with kev what is up my family we are back and we are on these horror stories in roblox you guys i wanted to freaking look at some more horror stories and this one is the cute little doll this one caught my attention as soon as soon as i got in here i just looked over there and i said what is this doll just sitting what is this doll just sitting right here like this for let's go in here and check out the cute little doll oh my gosh oh look at it oh so he's in the store i'm going to buy this cute little doll for my daughter's birthday she's gonna be so happy okay so this is a father his daughter's birthday is today and he just wants to buy her a doll he wants to make her happy the guy at the register says how are you sir that'll be 20.99 since it's a rare antique what he's like what it'll be a worth gift for lucy i guess what he's saying is it'll be worth it 20.99 for a doll i mean this better be a, a, a very special doll but he says he thinks that it'll be worth it and i like the suit my boy you pretty fresh i gotta i must admit you pretty fresh all right i can't wait to surprise lucy oh gosh okay do we go in there all right we're going in here oh man oh so he gets home right here oh my boy got the basketball court out here though no, i see you my boy rings doorbell i'm back from work why why would he ring the doorbell why if this is his house he, sh he should have his own key <laughs> okay so do we go in there all right we're going this way let's see oh gosh happy birthday lucy i bought you a rare antique doll look he gave it to her he's so happy mom says ah so cute <laughs> and lucy says thank you dad i've always wanted a cute little sister look how freaking creepy this doll looks you guys but everybody's so happy right now uh-oh good night mom and dad i'm going to sleep with my little sister tonight uh-oh she's going upstairs oh man i don't know if i want lucy to go upstairs i mean she's all alone up there with this freaking crazy looking doll oh gosh okay uh where do we go where do we go okay we're going this way this way Are you kidding? Why would they do that? Why would they jump scare me like that? Oh my gosh. Okay, shifts and moves across the bed. All right, she's sleeping. Uh, The doll adjusts body, then gets up and starts to walk. Oh gosh. Doll's getting up. Six hours later, it's 3 a.m. Oh, dolls on the loose. Oh my gosh, do not come in here like that and scare me. Jeez. Uh, what does she do? Turns demonic and opens door. Oh, look at this demonic doll. Oh gosh. Oh, Lucy, you need to get up. Get up, Lucy. Lucy, get up. Please. Why am I in this horror story? Oh gosh. Oh, look at this. Walks back into room with a kitchen knife and smiles. She's smiling at Lucy. Oh my gosh. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where's my doll? What is it doing over there with a knife? Ah! Look at Lucy's face. She's so scared. She's so freaking scared. She doesn't even really have a face. <laughs> look at this. Oh my gosh. Okay. Let's go. Oh! Stop freaking doing that oh gosh she said miss me and then she stabs lucy ah ah lucy she just stabbed lucy and now this room is like freaking crazy looking this blood on the closet oh man she's really messed up this room you guys she's messed up she stabbed lucy okay what's over here oh gosh <gasps> oh and then i died that was a creepy little doll lucy oh man the cute little doll what about smile dog hmm okay smile dog why does he look so freaking <laughs> he looks really what why am i smile dog now wait can i pick up lucy by getting close to her wait i'm smile dog now you guys okay let's go in here 
I don't like these dark hallways. I'm gonna be honest. You guys, I don't, I do not like this. All right, let's go in here. Let's check out Smile Dog. Yawns. Ooh, where's my phone? Why is my phone buzzing this late at night? Buzz, buzz. Phone's buzzing. Pick up your phone, my boy. And you got the, you got the old iPhone. You need, to, you need to switch that up, my boy. Switch that up. Okay. So let's go in here. His phone's buzzing. He gets it, huh? Someone sent me a horrific picture of Smile Dog and is asking me to resend it to someone else. Oh, somebody sent them a, a horrific picture of Smile Dog, you guys. Oh, man. Oh, wait. Was it? The TV's moving. Wait, he's moving. Oh, that's kind of creepy. What's up, my girl? You trying to go with me? Her name is Cute Kitty Girl. What's up, Cute Kitty Girl? Come on. Come in here with your boy. All right, so what's going on? I'm going to delete this sin sender and picture and forget this ever happened. Okay, so he's saying somebody sent him a picture. I'm going to delete it, and I'm going to delete the person who sent me it. All right, and I'm going back to bed. <laughs> oh, going to sleep now. See, I told y'all I'm already knowing. So my boy's back to sleep. He deleted the picture. He's back to sleep. Oh, gosh. What is going on in here? Smile dogs everywhere. He gets up. What? What? How am I seeing that creepy image again? And this time it's everywhere. So they sent them freaking smile dog and smile dogs everywhere. Three days later, Michael kept seeing this image over and over. This drove him to pure insanity. Michael's going insane. Three days later, it drove him to pure insanity. Oh, this image. Oh, gosh. Smile Dog gives me chills, you guys. I, I, I can't take it anymore. I'm going to jump off this building. No, Michael. No. No, let us up there. No, I want to save Michael. I don't want him to do that. That's stupid of him to do that. I don't want him to do that. It's not a good decision. Okay. Oh, man. Goodbye, Smile Dog. Now I don't have to see your horrid face anymore. Michael dove off, you guys. He was so scared of horror. A freaking smile dog. That he dove off the building. Why would you do that, Michael? Oh! We have to be ready for those. Why are we never ready? Why are we never ready? Michael's on the ground. He's There's a lot of blood everywhere. And there's still smile dog pictures. That's why whenever anyone sends you a pic of Smile Dog, you must resend it to someone else. So if Michael would have just resent the picture of Smile Dog to somebody else, he would have freaking survived. He wouldn't Smile Dog wouldn't have never freaking killed him. Oh my gosh. All he had to do was resend the picture. Why did Come on, Michael? I mean, I wish I I wish I would have known that. I would have told Michael but I, I definitely didn't know that. Uh, the anonymous Camp Nightmare. Looks like people are running into Camp Nightmare. Oh, gosh. Oh, gosh. Let's check out Camp Nightmare. I'll go with you guys. You don't have to go by yourself. I will go with you. Do not worry about it. Oh, we're in Camp Nightmare. Uh, whoa. Uh, the best in history. Oh my God, this year's camp out is gonna be a blast. I know, right? Lighten up. Oh, he says, I don't know about this. So we got one guy that says, I don't know about this. And then it looks like the 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 leader or the general or, you know, the captain or, or he says, lighten up, will ya? We're gonna have the best time of our, of our freaking lives at this camp out. <laughs> he kind of messed up right there. Lives this camp out. I'm like, lives this camp out. Lives at this camp out. <laughs> okay, let's go over here. So this is the camp out right here, you guys. All right. So they're, they're by the fire. They're enjoying themselves. He says, dang, I don't feel good inside. I wish I could drink, but I'm just worried. He has a Sprite. My boy has a Sprite right here. I noticed you've been acting a bit strange. Here, drink up at least. So he hands him over the Sprite like, hey, you're acting a little bit crazy, my boy. Take some of this Sprite. Hit the, hit the Sprite one time. He chews, oh, chicken, 
This chicken legs taste good. Ooh, he put all of the O's too. That mean that chicken fire tastes good. <laughs> oh, I'm in the fire. Oh, gosh, let me out of here. Okay, yeah, I can't wait to sing our anthem. After eating and singing our anthem, we will go to bed and call it a day. Okay, so they're just hanging out by the fire, enjoying themselves. All right, here we go. Whoa. Oh, gosh. Where did this come from? It's dark in here. I'm seeing the woods. Oh, he's asleep. Hate to jump on you, my boy. <laughs> uh, ah, what a wuss. Why did he call him a wuss? He's like sad right here, laying down. Yes, sir. I'll unlight the fire for everyone to sleep sound. All right, folks. Unlight the fire. Go to sleep. So he's the one that told him to unlight it. All right, but he's calling him a wuss. He has this, he's sticking his tongue out too. He's sticking his tongue out, my boy. Wonder why he would just, why would he call him a wuss? Okay, oh. Oh gosh, everybody's sleeping. Look, they're sound asleep. They're snoring. Oh gosh. Zzz, he's asleep. 11.58 p.m. Someone seems to be walking quietly towards this camp. Da, 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 da. It gets closer. Oh, gosh. 11.58. They're walking closer towards the camp. Let's oh, gosh. That's Jason. Jason. Oh, gosh. You guys wake up. Wake up. They're still sleeping. Oh, whispers. He's whispering to him. Oh, we have a few defenseless campers in my force. I shall get rid of one per night. Ew, so he didn't whisper to him. He's whispering to us that he's going to kill one of them every night. Ew. The abductor has arrived. So it's 3 a.m. The abductor is there. All right, now it's 3.10. They're still sleeping. The abductor rearranged the sleeping bags and is leaving off with the camper. So he takes him. Why does he take the most scared one? <laughs> Until you took the most Sierra one abductor. Walks off with one of the coppers. Okay, walked off with one of the campers. Bye bye. Oh gosh. All right. Looks like it's the next morning. Ah. Uh, he says, "Why wasn't the the weird kid who had fears of the forest? Something is not right." Uh. Okay. He said, "Wasn't wasn't he the weird kid?" Uh, in any case, don't panic. I called 911 already. They'll be here in four days. Four days. Four days. Holy moly. Where did Jake go? So his name is Jake. Uh, maybe he's taking a leak outside in the woods and coming back soon. So he's saying maybe he's using the restroom in the woods and he may come back pretty soon here. Oh, gosh. 2 a.m. Whispers. Only three more to go. So he just keeps taking them every night, you guys. I wonder why none of these guys stay up. One of their buddies went missing and they just keep going to sleep. They're not even looking for him. Okay. Oh, next day. No, now Jimmy disappeared. So we got Jimmy and Jake. They both disappeared. We are all going to die. Look at their faces. <laughs> Don't panic. We're still okay. Police will arrive in three days and for tonight, I'll stay on guard. So finally, finally the captain, finally... The leader is staying on guard for the night. Ew. Wait. Oh, he sleeps while on duty, so he ended up going to sleep. The freaking abductor comes in and takes another body. There's only two guys left. The guy that's supposed to be up. He came at 2 a.m. <laughs> the guy that's supposed to be up and one of the other campers. There's only two people left. Oh, gosh. Okay. Uh... He said, if we don't get out of here before midnight, we are both doomed. He'll find us no matter where we are. Oh, if only we had weapons. So there's more. Wait, there's more campers out here. This time we are both going to stay alert through the night. Okay. Oh, these are the same guys. Okay. They're going to stay alert through the night. Oh, it's nighttime. What's going on over here? All right, sir. I'll be alert of my surroundings. Yeah, he might be stalking us right now. Something is not right. Okay, I'll be taking a leak in the woods. I'll be close by. So he's going to go take a look. He's going to go take a leak and a look <laughs> in the woods because he might be looking at his death. So this is the captain here, the leader. He's going to go take a leak. 
Everybody else is just kind of just chilling right here. All right. Uh, 2 a.m. One more night before the police arrives. Oh, gosh. Look at this. Oh, he said, mmm, appears out of nowhere and he takes the capper. Oh, gosh, the abductor. I'm back. Where did Danny go? So now he's by himself. He's all alone. He's all alone, you guys. Oh, wait. The police are coming. We are getting closer to the camp. They're in traffic. Police is coming, you guys. Is that a drone? <laughs> what? Oh, gosh. What's happening? What's happening? Oh, the camp is on fire. The camp is on fire. And he put a head. He put a head right there. Oh, why am I dying? You were too late. I'm dying from the fire. Go. Oh, the police are here. We were too late. Why am I dying, though? Why? No, I don't want to die from the fire. No. No. They were too late, you guys. The abductor took the last freaking person and he set the whole campsite on fire camp nightmare oh bloody mary i don't know if i want to deal with bloody mary we have the werewolf we have jeff the killer ah <sighs> i know you guys want me to go in here with i know you guys i already know y'all already you want me to go in here with bloody mary do you think i'm beautiful yeah actually you are pretty <laughs> pretty quite beautiful there my girl i must say oh bloody mary oh come on don't do that to me not creepy dolls emma truth or dare amanda uh amanda says the tr tr truth <laughs> she gulps uh this is gonna be awesome oh man so they're playing truth or dare uh emma i dare you to chant bloody mary three times in front of the mirror over there amanda says what are you insane <laughs> what uh, calm down, Amanda. Lucy says no one believes in Bloody Mary. Okay, I believe in her. Ah, fine. I should have never said dare. Also, oh, she's going for it. Amanda's going for it. Okay. Uh, whoa. Come on, please be a good sport. So she's going upstairs here. Ah, oh, she looks a little nervous. Okay. What's going on? Lucy, yeah, we're just trying to have some fun. So she's in the restroom, you guys. Uh, here's the mirror right here. I don't know, dude, it looks like they want me to, to click the mirror or something. Okay, let's go over here. Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary, Bloody Mary. She said it three times in the mirror, you guys. Look at her. Oh gosh, she's screaming it too. Amanda waits for about five minutes to see if anything would happen. Hmm. So she's waiting. She's kind of just sitting there trying to see what's, well, you know, what's going to happen here. I just said Bloody Mary three times. What's going to happen? Uh, all right. I'm going to leave now. And I'm glad that it was some crazy urban legend. So as she gets ready to leave, Bloody Mary comes out of the freaking mirror. You guys No. Look, she was all happy. She was like, oh, oh, good, good. I can, I'm not going to die. And then she comes out of the freaking mirror. Oh, gosh, Bloody Mary just popped up right here. What a fine, beautiful girl you are. I wish I looked like you. Amanda, mm, mm, she can't even talk. Bloody Mary's taking her, you guys. Look at her face. She's scared. Let's go over here. Oh, my God. It's been a while since Amanda left to do the dare. So they're looking for Amanda. Come on. Oh, they went in there. Oh my God, it's been a while, guys. I think we should check on her and call the game off for the night. And then they go in there and they see this. This is really creepy, you guys. Really, really creepy. Look at their faces. They're like scared. They're in shock. Oh gosh, they went in there and they saw that Bloody Mary took her. Guys, these were some awesome stories. If you guys enjoyed this gameplay, Please show your boys some love and support by smacking that thumbs up button right now. Subscribe if you haven't. And I will see you guys in the next video. I love y'all, man, from the bottom of my heart, as always. Peace.